Hello, this is Dutchman420. Tonight I want to talk about washing your plants. I've treated these plants with Mighty Wash a few days ago, and you can see there's spots on them. Plus I hit them with SLF100, but it's getting to the point where I notice and it's got poisons on them, and I don't want my cats or them. Plus, I just don't want the poisons. They're all like oils and stuff like that that clog up the leaf, the stomata of the leaf. So what I'm going to do is wash my plant. And the best way to go about doing it is kind of get down underneath. And if I can hit everything down underneath first. You know, because when you spray this shit, you try to get it all on the under. Plus a lot, that's where the mites live. So if you, the mighty wash killed them, that's where their little corpses are. So get them real good up underneath. It reminds me of Pulp Fiction, where they're washing them off in the backyard. Where he's like, you gentlemen, you've all been to county before. <laughs> and they're sitting there with the eyes squirting them. He's like, what do you guys look like? He's like, they look like a couple of dorks. <laughs> I'm sure if you're a Pulp Fiction fan, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Quentin Tarantino fucking... It's like, you're close, motherfucker. <laughs> but anyway, you get the idea. And then what I do is I put a fan on them to kind of shake them all and walk, dry them all. And I mean, wash them good, man. Get all this shit. You're just thinking a rainstorm in the fucking wild, man. What would be going on? So, what I'll do is I'll wash these. And I gotta go, unfortunately, to the store. And then I will be back and we'll take a look at them. Because you will see a difference in how they look. Cool. Well, as you see, I rinsed these off. I had sprayed them with some Mighty Wash. So what I do is I let the Mighty Wash dry in here for maybe two hours, and then I come back in and spray it with water, and then dry them again. And look how happy they look. Plus it washes the Mighty Wash off of them. The Mighty Wash, I don't think, really acts as a pest repellent. It might on the leaf, but I also think that when you, the shit dries on the leaf, then you wet it again, it may run into the little crevices and shit, too, and kill anything that it didn't the first time, so. And also wash away all their little corpses. So. Um, I have found mites on these nectar plants, so it's not like they're pest free but for the most part it's nothing like the salty ones you'll look and look and you won't see anything and then you'll find like one <laughs> you know but it's still once you see those little exoskeletons piled up and then you know you because that's from them molting into a bigger shell or whatever it is and what you find are these little clear it looks like little mites but they're really the little shells are broken in half the little clear things, it's their exoskeleton. And the Azimax basically kills them when they molt, they basically break in half and die. But, um, Mighty Wash fucking kills them from gases and stuff because I see their little corpses and they're perfect. They're not like encased in any kind of crystals or anything. They are just dead from the fumes, you know what I mean? So, anyway, I just wanted to. Let everyone see, you can wash your plants. Remember, it's just like when you're outside. If you plant outside and it rains, they get in a nice washing. It'll wash all the dust off of them and pests and other stuff. Nature has its own mighty wash, you know? So, anyway, there's that music again. Till next time, this is Dutchman420 saying, wash your plants. Keep on growing, smoking, extracting, and baking.